Hi everyone, this is Mike 89 and this is an addendum to my Sonic 3 and Knuckles speedrun tutorial series. Uh, the main reason for this addendum is that, as you'll see here, uh, Sonic and Tails is now the preferred uh, way to do the Sonic speedrun now. Uh, it's actually significantly faster in two other stages, not this one, however. Uh, so, we're going to go back to here, and the main thing that you want to do in this point, so everything up to this point in the stage is the same. We're right near the boss fight at the moment. Uh, the one thing you want to do is make sure that Tails does not land here with you. Uh, if Tails lands here with you, then uh, the two of you are going to be in sync for the remainder of the stage. We need Sonic and Tails to be out of sync. Um, and that's a difficult thing to do without controlling Tails at all, but we're going to try and do it. So we need to really quickly get this jump off before Tails actually hits the ground. So we didn't hear a second jump, so they're not in sync. That's what we want. That's what we want to hear. Uh, so everything else about getting to the boss uh, timely in a timely way is the same. Um, now what we want to see here is again we're going to duck and wait for the screen to switch, but. Again, we haven't seen Tails yet. Sonic and Tails are still out of sync. This is going to be really important in a second. Um, so, we do the same nine spin dashes over here to set up position. But now, the, now, the important thing to know is that Sonic is about here somewhere. Tails is actually one tile off to the right. That's going to be really important uh, when we get hit six. So... We're still holding the spin dash so that uh, we get the fifth hit on Robotnik here. Now, where before we would just hold right and go all the way over here, uh, what we're going to do this time is we're going to do three further spin dashes. So one, two, three. We're about here now. So Sonic's about here and Tails is about here. And again, we one, two, three, and then we hold this spin dash. You hear another spin dash being held there. That's just tails. Again, he's a tile behind you. Now, uh, so you can see exactly where Sonic is now. You can see the silhouette. Um, and again, tails is on the next tile. So what's going to happen is we're now going to just as the flame is about to reach you. So when it gets to about here, uh, we're then going to switch to holding left release the spin dash and hold left and what will happen is Sonic will release his spin dash which will move him back one tile he'll get hit by the flame importantly Tails will not get hit by the flame and they'll both once you've held left for a little while they'll both end up all the way over here on the right side of the screen when you press left so now they're both you can see that Sonic's collected the rings over here so they're both now on the left hand side now charge another spin dash, and there's Robotnik getting the seventh hit. But here's here's the interesting bit, because Tails wasn't hit before, he's not vulnerable now. So he now gets hit by the flames and he drops down. And Sonic gets the last hit and kills the boss. Now as soon as you see that, let go of your spin dash and immediately hold up. The screen will shift, and you'll see Tails over here on the right edge of the screen if you've done everything correctly. Now hold right. Oh, not not just yet. Now hold right. So, you can see Tails appears to be pushing to the left, but you're actually holding right here. Don't worry about that. When the, um, when the capsule gets to about here, jump. And what this will do is it will cause Tails to appear over here for a single frame. He'll break the capsule and die at the exact same time. When he drops off the bottom of the screen, he then respawns over here where Sonic is and the stage ends. So it's a little bit more convoluted, but it gets the job done in the end. Uh, it's actually a little bit slower than the Sonic only method. However, it is vitally important for two tricks later in the run uh, that I'll get to in the next two videos. 
So here's what that looks like all in one go with no interruptions. Okay.